Well, good morning. We want to welcome you to Cross Point this morning, and that's especially true if this is your first time with us. My name is Jason. I am the associate pastor here, and if you are new to our Cross Point Church community, we would love for you to take. A, I pulled the wrong paper out. This is this is actually how to give. So we're not going to go with that if you're new. Uh, there's a form that says welcome on it. And we'd love for you to take that, fill it out with as much information as you're happy or comfortable with, and then drop that in the offering plate when it comes by later so that we uh, can know a little bit more about you, how we can minister to you, how we can uh, answer any questions that you might have, and just how you can get to know our church a little bit better. And you can just drop that in the offering plate in a few moments. If you have a prayer request, please put that on there as well. Just a couple of announcements from our service program. You can read through there and see many of the new things that are beginning to start at our church. I want to make you aware of uh, three items. First, uh, for those of you that were part of the Incarcerated Youth Ministries um, retreat yesterday, uh, we thank you for being a part of that. I'm told it went very well. Um, Pastor Matt said that I should thank everyone for their prayers this morning. If you were praying for that, if you thought of that, uh, that the retreat itself went wonderfully. Pastor Matt is not with us this morning during this service. He's at another church. One of the uh, police officers, Pastor Matt is also uh, the chaplain for the Girls Point Woods Public Safety, and one of the police officers is being baptized this morning at his church. And so uh, Pastor Matt went over there to encourage him. Uh, the last thing that I want to make sure you're aware of is that on September the 17th, uh, we are going to host a lower level open house. The basement has been under construction for some time and is continuing to undergo construction and we ask that you pray that everything goes well. Uh, but we will be hopefully down there and it will be open by then. And on September 17th, that's a Sunday. After service is over, second service, we're going to open up the lower level and we encourage you to go down and take a look and see everything that has happened. Because after September 17th, on Sunday mornings specifically, that area of the church is going to be restricted only to those who have children down there or are working down there. And so we won't be able, just as a church, to go through and, and take tours uh, on a normal Sunday morning. Unfortunately, times have required us to take added steps when it comes to the security of our children, which we are happy to do as a church. And so we just ask that you honor that. Nobody's going to tackle you that I'm aware of if on the 24th you wander downstairs. But we will uh, take your picture. And that will be put on a wall, the wall of shame. Uh, so we just ask that on the 17th, come with us, come see everything that, that you've helped to do, what God has done down there. Uh, and then after that, if you're here during the week or, or you have a reason to be down there, by all means. But on Sundays, we're asking that you just respect, um, respect our children's ministry programs, which is going to allow for just those children and their families to be down there. At this time, let's pray over our offering. God.